Hi guys, welcome to my channel, Makai Muse. Today I'll be showing you how I did this sunset fire color eyeshadow. Um, it was really fun to create. I love how it matched my hair. So if you have red hair, this is a perfect look for you or any color hair. I just love it. I'll be starting with the medium deep um, Fit Me Loose setting powder and patting that into my eyebrows like so. And I'm going to take my NYX Eyebrow Gel and Espresso and my LA Pro Girl Concealer and Fawn and put those on a sticky note so that I can fill in my brows and conceal them. So first I'm just going to create the shape of my brows. I'm just going to buff those out a little. And I'm going to conceal them with the e.l.f. concealer brush. Then I'm just taking the start of the eyebrow I started with and dragging that over to the other eyebrow so that they're in the same spot and both eyebrows are even. Just blending out a little bit of that concealer with my fingers. I'm gonna apply my Becca um, primer and apply that all over my face usually I do my eyes first why I did my face first I have no idea The two palettes I use is the James Charles palette and then the Juvia's Place palette. And I'm starting by priming my eyelids with the lighter LA Pro Girl Concealer. And using that yellow shade in the Juvia's Place Zulu palette. And putting that up under my brow. Then I'm going to take that orange shade and apply it right up under it. Just be sure that you're blending in circular motions. And then I'm going to go back in that yellow shade since I lost a little bit of it from doing the orange. And now I'm taking this red-orange shade from the James Charles palette and blending that right into my crease. I use a smaller brush so that I can contain the color. I didn't want the red to get everywhere. Then just go back in with the orange or yellow if need be. Now I'm gonna cut my crease and create like a little dotted line and look up so it'll show me exactly where I need to put it. And just drag from the lines you created. Okay. 
I'm using the Modern Renaissance palette. I'm going to take this gold shade and apply that where all over I just put the conceal. <laughs> I'm gonna take the darkest red in the James Charles palette and put that in my outer corner just to deepen the red a little bit. Now I'm gonna take the leftover concealer for my brows and put it on that outside of outer part of my eye and then a lighter shade on the inner corner of my eye and blend those out with a damp beauty blender everywhere I put that concealer with the same medium deep loose setting powder and I'm contouring with the black radiance contour palette in medium to dark <laughs> Blending out and dusting off all that loose setting powder, making sure there's no harsh lines where my contour is. Setting my face with a dewy setting spray. I'm gonna highlight with Trophy Wife by Fenty Beauty. Putting that on the apple of my cheek, my nose, my forehead my cupid's bow, and my ear. I just added a little bit of the highlight up under my brow bone and in the inner corner of my eye. Then I'm gonna use this Lancome uh, mascara. and apply the Revlon Black is Black eyeliner. with the dual lash glue and apply them in the center of my eye and then secure down the outer corner and then the inner corner. And then just make sure that the entire lash is secured to your lashes. Using this chestnut um, lip liner, I'm going to line my lips and apply this Bonita lip gloss. I decided to add a clear lip gloss on top of that just to make my lips pop a little bit more. I wasn't satisfied with just the Bonita lip gloss. I feel like it just gave it a nice color. Now I'm using my Ben Eye Final Seal Setting Spray and applying that all over my face. That's the look guys. Thank you for watching. Make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe. And I'll be sure to insert some more videos.